The 1941 wheat penny is one of the most iconic coins minted in U.S. history. Part of the Lincoln Cent series, it was struck by the United States Mint from 1909 to 1958 and features two stalks of wheat on the reverse, giving it the nickname Wheat Penny. The 1941 penny, while not as rare or valuable as some other dates, holds significant historical and numismatic interest. In this essay, we will explore its design, historical context, and some fascinating facts that make it a favorite among collectors. The 1941 wheat penny was minted during an important period in U.S. and global history. The world was engulfed in World War II, and while the U.S. did not enter the conflict until December 1941, the economic and social conditions of the time were heavily influenced by the war. Pennies like the 1941 wheat cent were vital in the economy, as copper and other metals were crucial for the war effort, making every resource valuable. The obverse of the 1941 wheat penny features a portrait of Abraham Lincoln, the 16th President of the United States. This was designed by Victor D. Brenner in 1909 to commemorate the 100th anniversary of Lincoln's birth, and his portrait has remained on the penny ever since. The portrait is a right-facing bust of Lincoln, showing his profile from the chest upward. The simplicity of the design allows the focus to be on his dignified expression, which represents his significance in American history. In God We Trust This motto, placed above Lincoln's head, was first introduced on U.S. coins in 1864 and became standard on all U.S. coinage by 1938. It reflects the nation's religious sentiments at the time. Liberty This word appears to the left of Lincoln's bust and is a traditional element on American coins, signifying the country's core value of freedom. The year 1941 The date of minting is inscribed to the right of Lincoln's portrait. On coins struck at the Denver and San Francisco mints, you'll also see a small mint mark below the date, a D for Denver or an S for San Francisco. Pennies struck in Philadelphia do not have a mint mark. The reverse of the 1941 wheat penny is known as the wheat ears design, which gives the coin its popular nickname, the wheat penny. Two stalks of wheat frame the reverse on either side of the central inscriptions. The wheat symbolizes the country's agricultural abundance and prosperity and it also serves as a reminder of the importance of hard work and farming during the time the coin was minted. One cent. The denomination of the coin is boldly stated in the center. United States of America. Below the denomination, this inscription identifies the country of origin. A pluribus unum. Above the denomination is this Latin phrase, which means, out of many, one. It reflects the idea that the United States is made up of many different states and people, yet functions as a unified nation. The 1941 wheat penny is composed of 95% copper and 5% tin and zinc. This high copper content gives the coin its distinctive reddish-brown appearance. However, the demand for copper during World War II would eventually lead the U.S. Mint to change the composition of the penny in 1943, when it was made from zinc-coated steel to conserve copper for the war effort. Despite the turmoil of the early 1940s, the production numbers for the 1941 penny were remarkably high. Over 887 million pennies were minted that year between the three mints, Philadelphia, 684 million, Denver, 128 million, San Francisco, 92 million. As a result, the 1941 wheat penny is one of the more common dates for collectors, making it affordable even in high grades. The value of a 1941 wheat penny varies based on its condition, mint mark, and rarity of certain varieties. Circulated pennies are typically worth only a few cents, while uncirculated or mint state examples can fetch several dollars, especially those with sharp details and minimal wear. The Denver and San Francisco mint varieties tend to be slightly more valuable, especially in higher grades. Like many coins, the 1941 wheat penny has its share of minting errors and varieties that can greatly increase its value. For example, double die errors, where parts of the design appear to be stamped twice, are highly sought after by collectors. While no major errors are widely known for the 1941 wheat penny, any misstrikes or imperfections can make specific coins significantly more valuable. For many Americans during the 1940s, the penny played a vital role in everyday transactions. Whether used to buy a loaf of bread or saved in a jar, 
The penny was a common and trusted piece of currency. Its connection to Abraham Lincoln, one of America's most beloved presidents, also added to its sentimental value during a time when the nation faced uncertainty due to the war. The wheat penny design was discontinued in 1958, replaced by the Lincoln Memorial Reverse in 1959. This change marked the end of an era for U.S. coinage, but the wheat penny remains a favorite among numismatists. The 1941 penny, being one of the more common and affordable coins, often serves as a gateway for new collectors who wish to explore U.S. coin history. The 1941 wheat penny is a fascinating coin not only for its historical significance during the tumultuous years leading up to and during World War II, but also for its iconic design and place in American culture. Though common in the world of coin collecting, the 1941 wheat penny offers a glimpse into a different time in U.S. history and is cherished for its beauty and symbolism. Whether for historical interest or numismatic value, the 1941 wheat penny continues to captivate both casual observers and serious collectors alike. The value of a 1941 Lincoln wheat penny varies based on its condition and mint mark. In circulated condition, it typically ranges from 5 to 20 cents. Uncirculated or mint state pennies can be worth $3 to $5 or more, and highly graded specimens can fetch even higher prices.